What is up you guys? It's Katya Books. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, feel free to subscribe. Um, yeah, so we're doing a full day of eating and maybe I'll throw in a workout. I'm hoping I'll be able to film my workout today. I think we have legs today. Um, but anyways, yes, just to start this video off, I'm kind of low carb at the moment. I mean, it's like 110 carbs. Not gonna fully give out all my macros because I don't want people copying them thinking they will get the same results. But throughout the day, I will throw in just some quick little like weight loss-ish tips to help you feel satiated through the day if you are going through some kind of cut. Of course, I think if anybody is doing some kind of cut, they should be doing it very carefully, ideally with some kind of coach. If you want me to coach you, uh, I got my email down below. But anyways, yeah, we're gonna get started with breakfast, the best meal of the day. Um, yes, and then, I mean, I work full time as well. I, yeah, I don't know if I've mentioned that to you guys if you're new. Um, yes, so I work from home. COVID. Mm. But anyways, let's go get started with the first meal of the day, breakfast. I need to interrupt, this is so funny. Um, so I added glutamine powder as well to my oats, but you gotta see with the scale. Like what the heck? Oh my gosh. Just had to share that with you guys. Okay, on to continuing making breakfast. So my breakfast right here, it is a little lower carb friendly in that I used a zucchini to replace most of the oats to give it some more volume. You barely taste it and especially when you add protein powder, a good flavored protein powder like Live Body. Oh my gosh, it is a delicious breakfast. Now for a quick also fat loss, weight loss little tip because I know people like to eat quickly. Make sure your food is actually pretty hot because it'll make you eat slower because it can take your body up to 20 minutes for the signals to tell your brain that you're full. So to eat slower, just heat up your food a little more. If it's cold, I mean, make it maybe freezing cold. I don't know, but I'm gonna enjoy that. I got some coffee. That silk protein milk is so good. It is soy based, so if you don't, you know, you're allergic to soy, don't have it, but don't be afraid of soy. It's good for you. So I'm gonna eat this now. Mm. 
All right, so breakfast was amazing. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with the pumpkin pie vegan protein powder from Live Body. Like, I don't care. Oh, I could have that flavor all year round. So I'm not 100% sure if it is like limited edition or it is permanent on their website, but otherwise, all of their flavors are so good for their vegan protein powders. So go check them out. You can use my coupon code. Yeah, I'm gonna get going to work because your girl works full time. This is my setup. So look how cute this is. It's a hamster mouse. Oh my gosh. So yeah, I'm gonna do some of that. Um, and then I'll catch you for whatever. I have a snack. I am gonna get a bottle of water to have with me because stay hydrated. So, catch you in a bit. All right, so you guys kind of saw what I prepared here. Some like stir-fried tofu with like stir-fried vegetables with some vegan kimchi on top with a little bit of sesame seeds on top. So as you saw from like the aminos, I loosely um, track the sodium intake for my day because all the other foods I eat are usually very low sodium. So I'm not too concerned when I add stuff like liquid aminos um, and it like some of it evaporates and stuff. So it's whatever and I'm not like on prep right now so those like little things I'm loose about but if I was like on a prep I would totally count it otherwise I'm just gonna have strawberry zevia they came out with like a strawberry and orange soda I need to try their orange soda but the strawberry is really good so I'm gonna enjoy this watch a little Netflix while I take a break from work and then get back to it all right so I think it's time for some afternoon tea afternoon tea and a, probably a little snack as well. So I just made some, this is like a black tea with some like bergamot or something of the sort. It's really delicious. And I'll add a little bit of that silk high protein milk in it. That stuff is so bomb and it's crazy. For the eight ounces, it's 20 grams of protein. It's like a soy based, um, I think I talked about it before. But yeah, delicious, I found it at Walmart. So you should be able to find it at your regular grocery store as of a snack i think i'm gonna have some rice cakes do i feel like having depends how many carbs i feel like having right now or i might have a protein bar or a wrap i can't decide i'll get back to you in a second okay so i decided on a snack i'm gonna have two rice cakes because that's what i have left and then I'm gonna make like a protein sludge to put on top of them with the Sun Warrior Collagen Building Protein in a salted 
caramel. Oh my gosh, it's my favorite flavor out of all three. I know in my last review, people still had questions that were kind of an answer that I didn't talk about, but I wanna do an up-to-date like review on that since I've been taking it for quite a while and just in regards to like the collagen building properties and like the effects that I've had from it. Um, of course, the effects, not bad, <laughs> good. Um, and whoops, sorry about that. Um, but yeah, I wanna give an updated review on that. So stay tuned for that. That'll be out in a bit, but as for now, I'll show you how I make the sludge. So I added too much water. Um, so not the best example of the protein sludge. So I'm gonna add a little more of the powder in it to get it until it's like a thicker consistency. <laughs> So I added, as you saw, a little bit of this nocciolata. I don't know how to pronounce it, but they came out with a dairy-free hazelnut cocoa spread, so pretty much like a vegan Nutella. I think it's better than the Nutiva brand, if you've tried that one before. But yeah, I'm gonna just like, I'll have to show you, slather on a bit, because salted caramel, I thought, and chocolate would go so well together. Like, why not? Mm. Mm. I'm gonna have chocolate all over my face. Mmm. Oh my gosh. I know what to expect from that combo. So good. Favorite flavor. I love their chocolate and vanilla. Don't get me wrong, but salted caramel. I have some recipes actually planned with this, but if you want to try it yourself, feel free to use my coupon code so you can save like 20%. Because that always helps and it supports your girl and saves you money and it's just freaking delicious. So, mmm. Mmm. Got my tea. I'm going to add some of that silk milk in it and yeah get back to work all right so getting ready for the gym and today we've got leg day yes my leg of this shirt always got a rockets on leg day but we're doing like deadlifts and such today so pretty stoked for that plus it's deload so that's nice um but anyway so yeah i gotta find some leggings because still in the sweatpants so yeah, I'll see if I have a quick snack before we get to the gym. Otherwise, I'll catch you in my car for pre-workout and such. All right, so off to the gym we go. And I had a little bit of protein sludge. So it was just like the same live body protein mixed with a little bit of water. But for my pre-workouts, um, on the way to the gym, since it's like 25 minutes away from me, Green Monsters, I've been obsessed with this flavor. Was able to find them in like a pack of like, 10 or 12 and then i've also got my creatine so yeah i'm back on that creatine game but um it's the lean creatine from live body so yo check this out i love it because they use the crealkaline and that's like the non-bloating version so my old video of when i took like regular creatine monohydrate i know that's gotten like a lot of views um yeah, ever since I tried reintroducing monohydrate, it just like caused issues gastrointestinally for some reason. And that, no issues whatsoever. And the flavor is like the sour candy watermelon. It's so freaking good. Like I'll dry scoop it. I don't recommend doing it because it's pretty sour. But if you like sour candy, um, you'll enjoy that flavor. Hopefully they come out with more flavors because I freaking love that. It's like the non-stim and then of course I get my stimulant from the monster and then I also stack on, on upper body days, I'll stack on extra citrulline just for a nice pump. So, I mean, you won't see me taking that but that's what I'll be taking on the car ride to the gym. So, I'll catch you guys for deadlifts. Hell yeah.
So I don't know how well you can hear me over the sound of the gym and everything, but yeah, so even after leg day, I still have to do cardio, so gonna get on the Stairmaster. Sorry, I couldn't film like every set of everything, but that would make this video super long. Um, yeah, just helping some friends with mobility and stuff in between, because I don't know, I like my specific cardio machine. 20 minutes interval, so gonna do that right now. All right, here's my post-workout and post-cardio face. So yeah, I'm back home. My parents are watching a movie inside, so it's quite loud, but I'm gonna just get in the kitchen and you guys can follow me while I eat. I got home a little later than I wanted to. I was helping some friends out with cues and stuff for powerlifting. So yeah, but love them to death. I uh, also passed out some cookies. So yeah, catch you guys in the kitchen. Okay, my friends. I am so tired. Oh my gosh, it was a good workout. Deload week, all that. Got me some tea. Had my last meal, some shirataki noodles and the Gardein chicken. I'm obsessed with Gardein's mock meats. If you are vegan and you're looking for a good mock meat, Gardein is bomb. It's been the best. It's like all their different meats taste different where I've tried other brands where they're beef crumbles taste the same as like their chicken and it's just kind of like I don't know tastes weird but mm. so yeah I'm just gonna sip up that tea but if you enjoyed this video please do give it a thumbs up or, or a shaka if you want uh whatever you want if you haven't already do subscribe join the fit fam and I think next we've got some baking video for you guys yo i'm so stoked for that so it's coming a long way with all the baking and everything but yeah i love you guys go get those gains stay safe stay healthy and catch you in the next video bye <laughs>